Well, hello my friends and welcome back to my channel. Today we're gonna be setting up how I'm gonna be tracking my mileage in my 2019 business planner. And I am gonna tell you about this stuff first and I'll tell you about the business planner in a moment. So I'm gonna be using this. This actually came with uh, a planner that I got already, but it didn't come with this specific planner. Um, this one came with my Erin Condren Life Planner for 2019. It has the Woven Wonder pattern on it. I'm gonna use it because I'm gonna be making a little chart. and then this pen is the Pilot Ultra Fine Point Permanent Marker, um, and I'm gonna be using this on some of my Christian Design stickers, which I'll show you in just a moment. And then also this Erin Condren Dual Tip Marker, which is why my finger is blue at the moment, because I just filmed another video before and tried to clean up something and you know, whatever. Um, and then also I have this washi sample from my shop, link is below, as well as a little coupon code if you're interested. And this is kind of like a transportation washi, I believe is what I ended up calling it. And then I have this sheet from Coffee Break Planner that has like these little road stickers and then some little cars, which I think is awesome. I'm also going to be using these two sticker sheets from Chrissy and Designs, and I will link her shop below, as well as everything, all the other sources that I'm using today, including the pens. And this is KAD00232, and then I'm almost out of this sheet. I always get like really excited when I finish a sheet. I'm not gonna finish the sheet today, but I get very excited. I know some people feel really, really sad when they finish a sheet, but I feel the complete opposite. So this one is KAD00485. And then um, the planner that I am currently using for my business is an Erin Condren Deluxe Monthly Planner. And I got the 12, I got, it only comes in a 12 month version. I'm trying to like get my words right. It only comes in a 12 month version, but I did get January through December and I got the maximum amount of notes pages possible. And I believe it was 120, don't quote me on that, but you could get a ton of notes pages. I will also leave links below to all the other things that I've set up in this planner. Um, basically half the planner is notes pages and I have done a bunch of other tracking setup in those notes pages already. So let's get on to the video. So I'm gonna start by using the washi. And actually, let's let's move some things around and make it a little bit easier for everybody to see. Make sure the whole class can see. Oh, don't zoom out, you gotta zoom in. Okay, perfect. All right, so this is like a little road scene. And then I use uh, this little bookmark from Chris, or not Christian today as well. Woo, all right, start over again. I use this little bookmark from Erin Condren. It's just one of those snap-in ones. And then I'm gonna, there we go. And then I'm just kind of smoothing out the washi. All right. And then I thought underneath that, this little road washi, or not washi, but road strip sticker from Coffee Break Planner would look really, really cute. And I think it's about the right size. Even though I, I realize on the washi, they're on a road, but when I have things like already in my arsenal, I love using them up. It's like one of my favorite things. Oh, there's like a little tail. There we go. Oh, that, I feel like that just like really defines it a lot more. I like that a lot. Very cute. Okay, so on to the tracking. I am gonna be putting in a few different things. I'm gonna use, oh darn it, maybe I won't use these. Burp, burp, burp. Actually, yes, I can still make it work. I was gonna use the purple, but then there's no purple in the washi. I thought that there was a little bit of purple, but it's more like a primary color situation. But there is, there's some blue. So I'm gonna use this blue, and then I'll use some other colors here. So I'm gonna put in date, destination, miles, and then like a total, like a cumulative total at the end. Actually, no, I'm still gonna use the same sheet, but just like a, the same type of sheet, but just a different one. Cause I wanna use, 
I think I'm just gonna use the yellows, like something in the spectrum of the yellows, because I got that little ambulance right there. Okay, so now I have them all written down, so let's peel these bad boys off. I'm gonna put the date on the left-hand side. There we go. <laughs> Took a moment to peel off here. And then we've got the destination. I'm just kind of centering it in the middle of the line because I'm gonna do a little something in a moment. And then I'm gonna take total and put that at the very, very end to kind of just see how much space I have to work with here. I'm gonna kind of hang, I'm gonna hang this one over just a little bit because the miles are gonna get you know, bigger as the year goes on. And then miles will just go right over here. That is crooked. Okay, hold on, hold on. All right, not crooked anymore. At least I don't think so. I mean, you guys will tell me in the comments, I am sure. <laughs> what I think I'm gonna do is I'm gonna use another one of these strips, cause you know, if you have it, why not use it? And I am going to use this uh, line as a guide for myself. Actually, hold on. I keep messing everything up today. <laughs> All right, hold on. I'm gonna use do this over one more time. I'm gonna move this just a little bit over. And the awesome thing about Coffee Break Planner stickers is they are matte removable. And I have removed stuff from like eight months ago with really like no issue and it not, you know, coming up on my paper or anything. Like the, the paper didn't like rip off or anything like that. And I can still use the sticker, which is kind of cool. So I am going to make a little line on here. So I'm gonna be using my Erin Condren dual tip marker and I opened up the wrong side. We are gonna use the fine point for this. Hold on, we're gonna just put that up there for a moment. All right, I'm gonna move this little guy over. I'm also going to use this sheet from Chrissy and Designs. It is the KAD0075. I'm gonna use this little yellow sticker that's got some polka dots in there and just write mileage tracker on here. All right, I'm just gonna plop this up on the top there. And I think I'm gonna use two of these little blue cars, also from that Coffee Break Planner thing. And then just put these two little blue cars on there because there's a blue car here. You know, you guys know I like my consistency. And no, my car is not blue. Oh my gosh, I'm so sorry. You were not in the frame. Oh, I'm horrible. I'm sorry, guys. This whole time. <laughs> once in a while, I should look up at the viewfinder. I mean, just once in a while. But clearly, I am a failure. But now you can see what I was working on. Oh my gosh, I feel so stupid. Uh, whoopsie doopsie. Oh well, I hope you guys can forgive me. Also, I just noticed this. I love this little blue car. I'm gonna put this next to this little destination too, cause you know, cuteness and whatnot. Okay, now, I, now I'm done after you guys didn't see any of this stuff that I showed. Great, this is fabulous. All right, so I'm gonna move this little guy down here. It's just kind of off camera at the moment. All right, so this is my mileage tracker for my business planner for 2019. If you guys track mileage, let me know how you do it. Like if you do it in a decorative way like this, I know there's like apps and stuff like that that you can do on your phone, but if you track it in like a paper way, let me know in the comments down below what you use. Also, if you have any questions, let me know down below. I will link all the sources as well as my nail color. I get a lot of questions on my nails recently, so I will leave that in a link down below for you guys as well. If you like the video, make sure to give 
give it a thumbs up. Feel free to subscribe if you'd like to join the FDE family. And I will see you guys in the next one. Bye, guys. Well, folks, it's time to kick it old school. Uh, so you